Hello and welcome to Kendra's Card Challenge Super Sponsor Inspiration Hop featuring Cat Scrappiness. Today I'll be featuring products from our super sponsor, Cat Scrappiness. Thank you so much, Cat Scrappiness. So I am part of a collaboration hop with my teammates and we are all working with Cat Scrappiness today. There is a hop link listed down below if you'd like to hop along and we sure would appreciate if you did and i am using these darling summer koalas or not koalas quakas <laughs> and um this die set that is a standalone with a shadow die it says summer vibes and i'll be using the glitter galore paper from cat scrappiness along with some paper from my stash some alcohol markers some ink a little makeup brush, the coordinating dies. So to get started, we need to cut our piece of paper, which is three and three quarters by three and three quarters. And I'm gonna mask this off with just some mint tape. And at first you see me trying to mask it off here, but my hand's in the way, I can't see <laughs> to get a straight line. I'm gonna try it again. Hmm, no, no, okay, here's an idea. Let's try to do it where I can actually see what I'm doing. I only want a little bit of sky, I want mostly sand. So I'm gonna create my sand using some Gina K ink. And I'm just um, doing, I, I want a rough job of the blending. So I'm purposely putting brush marks in um, so that it looks like the sand's, you know, been tread through. It's not, not pristine. Little Quaka has to share the beach. And then I'm gonna take a darker brown, add a little bit of water and add some darker brown splatters to it to just kind of give it a more of a sandy effect. Not a big deal, super easy. You can add white splatters too if you want to, if you want to get it really, really sandy. Um, throw some shells in there, whatever you want to do. <laughs> but for now, I'm just splattering with the darker color here. And then I'm going to remove my mint tape and I'm going to do some blue ink blending on the top to represent my sky. And it doesn't matter if it goes over that horizon line or not, it's, it's better to kind of slightly blur that out. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I'm just ink blending on here, kind of willy-nilly. I've got a little, little boo-boo there, but it'll be fine. Not a huge deal. So we're gonna, first of all, put together our card base so that all we have left to, add, to do is add our uh, decorations basically. And so I have this beautiful blue, which reminds me of sparkling, like a sparkling pool, which I absolutely love. This is probably my favorite. Nah, I can't pick a favorite, but I'm going to go ahead and mat this um, scene layer onto that. And then I've got the two strips. So this is uh, sketch nine and I am doing it in portrait mode rather than landscape so that I can fit everything on here. So I'm going to go ahead and glue this piece down, just making sure that I've got even borders on the top and sides. And then I'll stick the two pieces of paper together uh, using a piece of mint tape and then just trim off any excess. So um, if you aren't familiar with Kendra's card challenge, uh, there is a link down below. And with this hop, there is a digital prize from Kendra. All you need to do is fill out the claim form or fill out the form down below and you'll be entered to win the prize and the prize will be announced winners will be announced on the cards by kendra um youtube page so make sure you're subscribed and you have your notifications turned on so you know if you won so um, i've got my card base all together now all i need to do is stamp out my quakas and color them and put it all together cut them out and get it all put together so I'm gonna do the umbrella, I'm gonna do the quokka that's relaxing by the beach, and I'll do a little sand dollar here, or a, a little, um, what are those things called, starfish. Yeah, that. Ah, you'd think I know, I grew up on the coast. <laughs> I am gonna stamp these out with memento because I will be coloring with alcohol ink. So if, um, if you've not, never hopped along or heard of Kendra's Card Challenge, definitely um, you can learn more uh, through the links down below. But basically, um, Kendra every quarter puts out a, a PDF file, and that can be found on her website, um, kendrascardchallenges.com. 
and she puts out a PDF file with 15 card sketches uh, that you cut out of six pieces of pattern paper, you know, plus your own paper from your stash. But the point is, is that the six pieces of pattern paper. And if you do the 15 cards and you take a picture and post it in the appropriate album on the Facebook group, then you're entered to, for a chance to win one of the big prizes from our sponsors. It's a lot of fun watching uh, when Kendra does the um, giveaway because she, you know, she does a like a premiere video, and there's so many names. I'm just blown away by how many people enter, and it is just so much fun. And before you know it, you've got a card stash built up like crazy. So I've got just getting this all colored in, and I'm just kind of going in here and darken darkening the back portions of the umbrella with just a second layer of. Ink. I'm not doing any fancy coloring, just simple coloring here. So anyway, back to um, the drawing. You must be 18 to um, enter, 18 or over. Um, let's see. Then I just want to make sure I cover everything because I always forget to tell you guys something. <laughs> So uh, Kendra also has a patron group and um, she has several levels of membership with many, many benefits, uh, you know, aside from the free. So the Kendra's card challenge itself is absolutely free. And um, so now I'm just kind of coloring in my little fur and I'm still kind of new at, you know, critters. So <laughs> you have to bear with me while I figure them out and I'll get it figured out. But I'm basically just putting shadows where I think shadows should be. Um, so as I mentioned in the beginning, this is a hop. Uh, there is a link down below for the hop playlist. And all you need to do is click that link and then you can just follow on, relax and follow along the hop. And uh, make sure you give everybody some love and, as you hop along and fill out that prize claim form. Or that, um, not prize claim form, but the entry form. So I'm just blending everything in here now, best I can, with what I have. <laughs> it's a lot of fun learning, I'm telling you. You could just color it. It's one solid color, and it would be just fine. So I've got this little pink color, too. Uh, let's finish up his legs, though. I forgot to do his legs chubby little legs. <laughs> I love his little green trunks. So I've got this pink color and I'm doing his nose and his ears and his feet and the lemonade. So he's got an ice cold glass of lemonade, little lemon wedge in it. And then I'm going to take a green, um, kind of a neon green gel pen and color in the rims of his glasses and then color the blue as if he were staring at a, out at a beach or a beautiful pool or whatever. And then let's don't forget his tail. Yeah, I think that might be kind of important. And little starfish, I'm just using a little, little bit of pink just in the center. All right, so I've got everything ready, cut out and ready to go. I'm gonna pop up the little quokka and just with some foam squares. But before I do that, I'm just gonna take this little makeup brush and along the bottom of the rail of the chair, I'm gonna color that in so that it looks like sand as well. I'm not gonna bother with all the splatter because you know I'm gonna get it everywhere. All right, so we're gonna put quokka there. And I'll just use a few strips of foam tape. And I'm looking for a yeah, a decent size here. That I don't know what kind of crafter you are, but I have so many different foam tapes. Sometimes I have to sort through to figure out what's the right one. And then there's some that are just, no, I, I shouldn't have bought this. <laughs> okay, so we know he's going to get popped up there, and I know I'm going to pop up my summer vibes, which I did also. Um, I did use a cream-colored um, card base for this, and the shadow layer around the summer vibes is also a cream color with the um the beautiful blue watery color of the for the words so we'll just peel off the backing and we'll get that everything placed down and then i'm going to add some embellishment to this as well okay he's going to sit right there that works i'm going to glue the little starfish down just kind of like right beside him maybe it just crawled up out of that beautiful blue water and i'll be using the sun-kissed um, 
sequins in different colors. So all we need to do really is just put our cinnamon on and add our embellishments and our card is finished. I hope to see a lot of you entering in, into Kendra's card challenge. It's just so much fun. And um, thanks again to our super sponsor, uh, Cat Scrappiness. Thank you for sending us product. Thank you for sponsoring prizes for, you know, the winners of Kendra's Card Challenge. And I thank you so much for stopping by my channel. Take care of yourself. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah. And don't forget the links down below. Bye-bye.